This is Joe Resnell with the front line with Joe and Joe. Once again, let us go into the breach. The liberal media dismisses Biden classified documents discovery. MSNBC's Rachel Maddow calls it a brief flurry of excitement on the right. The view gives Joe the benefit of the doubt. And the New York slimes shuts down Trump comparisons. By the way, these same personalities immediately tore into Trump after it was revealed he took classified materials from the White House to his residence at Mar-a-Lago in Florida. Couple points. One, obviously there's a double standard here. That's as clear as day, but that's the low hanging fruit. Anyone could basically make that observation. What I want to emphasize is this. What happened to Donald Trump, particularly around the raid at his home in Mar-a-Lago in Florida, was dangerous. It was an overreach. Merrick Garland, if all things were equal, should be fired. Absolutely fired. He basically put forth the, the Gestapo to go to Donald Trump's house. They crafted a subpoena that was not specific. They didn't even know what they were looking for. Ultimately, it was an act of political aggression. Joe Biden's regime attacked a political rival, and half the country doesn't care about it. Half the country could care less. That, my friends, is scary. Why? Because that action is dangerous. Why? Because guess who's next? You. If they did that to Donald Trump, they could do that to you. This was nothing more than a witch hunt, a witch hunt that has been going on since he began his campaigning. Russian collusion. We can go on and on all the way to his taxes that are just bit that just were released and nothing came of it. It's nothing more than a witch hunt. People have such hatred for this man and they're so blinded they can care less that the biden regime has overstepped their authority once again if you don't care you should care why because the next people they're going to come after is you